This video will show you analytics data available with WebEx Cloud Connected UC. You can access this data by clicking on the analytics link on the left navigation bar and then on the Connected UC tab. You will see analytics on the service experience with data on the call volume status and call audio quality, on asset usage with data on call count trend, call duration trend, endpoint adoption, and headset adoption. By default, the charts are for all your clusters. You can choose to restrict the data to a specific cluster. And as you can see, the charts are updated accordingly. You can change the date range. By default, it is the last 30 days, but there are other options available up to the last 12 months. With COVID-19, you might have many employees working from home with endpoints connecting via MRA. If you want to have analytics focus on those MRA endpoints, simply select the MRA toggle. Let's drill down on the call volume status chart. You can see that there are 8,399 total attempted calls, 7,919 successful calls, 480 fail calls, and zero drop calls. A lot of charts are available, such as call status distribution, call status trend, endpoint media capability, endpoint series with data on the DX series, Jabber, 8800, for example, distribution by time, and much more. You can customize those charts. You can move the charts around. You can delete charts. You can add them back. You can download the data into a CSV file. The CSV file contains a lot more information, so it can be useful if you need more details. You can apply some filters and get some specific insights. For example, let's look at the failed calls. Let's filter on the failed calls using the filters bar. And let's try to narrow down where those failed calls are coming from. Let's look at the call failure analysis and let's filter on the rejected calls. As you can see, the charts are updated accordingly and we were able to narrow down those rejected calls to the San Jose location and the California device pool. Let's look at the call audio quality. The call audio quality data provides insights around the number of good calls versus poor calls versus acceptable calls. We categorize calls to be good, poor, or acceptable based upon the SCSR metric of severely concealed seconds ratio that we find in the CMRs. If you want more details, this is documented in help.webex.com. Let's Look at the asset usage analytics. We have a chart on call count trend. Call duration trend. And endpoint adoption and headset adoption. You can see the number of configure endpoints and register endpoints and the number of endpoints placing calls based on the number of calls they participate in. So if you just purchased endpoints and headset for your organizations, this charts can help you understand if you're getting a good adoption of the investment that you just made. 
And for example, if you are getting a low adoption, you can further investigate by reaching out to your team or to the users to understand why the endpoints are not registered, why they are not being actively used, and possibly provide some training or reallocate phones to other users. You could also remove unutilized phones if you're getting close to your cluster full capacity. Finally, we are in the process of adding two types of analytics. The first one is around traffic analysis with data on call traffic locations, showing data on the top five call traffic locations, and data on call traffic analysis showing insights on the type of call being placed, for example, point-to-point -point calls, conference call, hybrid calls, or calls over a SIP trunks. The second set of analytics is for capacity analysis. It will, for example, show trunk usage for specific trunks or per trunk types. This concludes the demo on analytics in WebEx Cloud Connected UC. Thanks for watching.